Hey guys. Hey guys. We're the Dorkeries. We are the Dorkeries. And I'm going to say, you smell really yeah. good today. I love it when you say that. Yeah, you do. I'll well, take this a little shower and a little <laughs> body spray, but yeah. It smells so good. Happy Monday, Drew. Happy Monday after a fun filled weekend where we sorted so many bricks, <laughs> loaded so many bricks. So we are sending off BrickLink orders right now, and then we're going to head to Magic Kingdom, and we just wanted to share our day with you. Thank you for always joining us on the door cruise. It's going to be a fun Monday. Yay! Drew is starting us off right with some BrickLink orders yeah, going guys, out the door. I said is, orders. This is tomorrow's order that I just started working on. Wow. Bit. It's, I'm Somebody? glad. 90? 90? 90 of those? 90 of those. That's amazing. It wipes me out of those. Also, I'm admiring your... So if you're your, looking uh, for a... I'm admiring your... Show me the money award next to the Stormtrooper. It's I don't know. What do you call this? Your desk decor? Yeah. Which, this is what dropped off. We never, ever, ever <laughs> turn those in at fun days. I have a whole we just collection have a collection of, of them. This looks like complete chaos, but this is what I have been working on all weekend is sorting. So people ask us about us. Our friends ask us about this all the time. Like, what is this? Where does this even come from? But we have tubs and tubs like this in the garage that are just filled with inventory. And I just start digging in and I start figuring out you know, separating, separating them and different areas. And then like, so that's all one kind of Lego and then that's all one kind of Lego. And those are plates that need to be put in. So I separate them as much as I can. And then I start loading them into BrickLink and that has been my weekend, but it is a lot of fun. And I've just decided that, you know, what's the difference in spending the weekend playing games on my phone? or uh, sorting Lego. It's the same kind of game, just this one gets put into our BrickLink store. Oh, I'm so mad. What are you doing? Drew, tell everyone where we're at now. We are in Space Mountain. <laughs> we're about to get on the run. Nope. <laughs> you are wrong. Not even close. You are wrong. We're going to go see We Bear Bears. We Bear Bears. They're still getting set up inside, so just hang tight. The show will be ready to go in 10 minutes. And then we're doing what they said. See it again and again. <laughs> How many times have you seen the new Country Bear Jamboree? This has been my third time. Third time. How did you feel the first time you saw it? Hated it. How do you feel the second time? It wasn't so bad. How do you feel right now? Excited. <laughs> That's exactly what I said. I feel like you're just copying me. <laughs> like you're just we copying. We are one. <laughs> we are Venom. I like looking through all the country bear memorabilia around the room. All their fan mail. I love your show. Happy holidays, gang. Oh, look at this one. It looks like Winnie the Pooh up there. That's so cute. Very Poppins. I would legit hang these up in my house. I like the old frames and the old artwork. So be on the lookout if you see anywhere, any of them anywhere. Ah, uh, every time I'm in line for Country Bear Memory, these guys come out and have a hoedown. I have to watch it from a distance. So Chippendale, Big Al, Clara Bell's over here. Dancing. 
folks, welcome to the one and only original country band musical category featuring a wild and wooly assortment of grizzled old grizzlies singing a little country, a little western, and a whole lot of everything in between. So get those paws tapping and those claws clapping for five bears who need no introduction, but I'll give them one anyway. Let's hear it for the five bear rocks! Hit it, boys! I tried and tried to get a pass to ride Tiana's Bayou today, and it was all filled up. But it still looks so nice watching everybody come around. Where's the next car? The next, is that a log? The next log? Drew and I grew up next to Liberty Land where they had the log ride. And I was terrified of that thing as a kid. But I rode it every time. Because everyone begged me to. These are a long time in between. I was hoping to get to see a couple, but. These are American beauty berries. Are you looking up plants for me? American it's really pretty. Aw, look how pretty that is. We're gonna miss you. Beautiful Liberty Bell. All right, let's get out of the sun. They should be eaten in small amounts. Really? Wow. All make jellies and we popped into Magic Kingdom today was, to eat? well, our kids asked. <laughs> Every once in a while, our kids will ask. They're, they're grown, teenagers grown in between, you know, that adult teenage place, you know, where you're in between. So when they ask for something like that, like they want to spend time with us at a park, we always hop on it. So they asked to come today. We came, we ate, we rode Space Mountain, and we watched Country Bear Jamboree. <laughs> and now they want to leave. Well, we're going so, to Home Goods. Yes, we're going to go to, we're we're gonna go, to Home Goods. With we're going to go look at some fall stuff um, at the Home Goods, and then we're going to go find. We have not found any good thrift stores in Florida, and we're going to be on the hunt because um, we like to look for things that are old and fun. So that's what we're doing now that the kids are done with Magic Kingdom. <laughs> Till today, that you can see four seasons back there. Cute. How much is it? Four dollars. But I really like the vibe. It's like an old school like pottery mug. And I like the colors. And it's kind of fall. It feels like kind of like a fall flower. It does. I'm gonna hold on to it. I already found some sweet pumpkins and Farrah said no. They were hideous. But here's the by the way, we came to a thrift store before we went to Home Goods. I think you said that though. 
we are uh, quite impressed with this right here. All seasons of Murder, She Wrote. I mean, how can you not love Murder, She Wrote? And then, of course, what's a thrift store without old Disney VHS tapes? Oh, Criminal Minds? Look at that. 1883. That's actually really good. And we found out the other day that the main girl from 1883, her right there, she's on Young Sheldon. We just started Young Sheldon. Actually, it's some really good. Of course, obviously, you can stream all this, but they have some really good shows. Better Call Saul, Walking Dead, Lord of the Rings. Good stuff. Just to give you a little perspective, look how gigantic this Goodwill store is. It's crazy. Fair, I'll give you a nickel if you try on some of these masks. <laughs> Why am I the one modeling them? You should model them. Oh, this is cool. You can be a Ninja Turtle with just the shell. Ant-Man. Blue. That's pretty impressive. It didn't touch, but it was still a little too Oh, here's another bag of pumpkins. I don't. <laughs> no. Good morning. We are back at it today. Drew has made me a cup of coffee. Drew, yeah. I should have had my new coffee mug from Goodwill, but I left it in the car last night, and it wasn't clean anyways. It needs to be put in the dishwasher. It's so pretty we found out it's handmade. It is handmade. You could see some of the places like where... But it's very well done handmade. Oh, yeah. Like, it's, it's not, not going like to fall apart. But to me, when you have, like, a pottery cup, like, that makes it special. Yeah. Anyways, we are back at it today. It is Tuesday. We have a lot of fun things today. Um... The boys have a big adventure tonight. They are going to the special premiere of Agatha All Along at AMC. And um, we got those tickets with our D23 membership, but we could only get two, so the boys are going to go. Lots of fun stuff today, but I'm starting right here with my hug in a mug and loading inventory. It's a good day. You look so cute. Thanks. I love your ET hat. Yeah, have I even worn this? Yet? I don't think so. It's, it's, think a it's a debut of a lot of things today. Well, but I did. We did vlog the day that we bought the hat. We did, but yeah, you never worn it. You never I debuted never it on the worn channel. It. We are doing a post office run. How many orders do you ship out today? Um, between eBay and Bricklink, I think it's around <laughs> fifteen. Around fifteen. Awesome, that's a good day. That's a great day. It's a good shipping day. And then we're going to meet a guy to sell. We did a vlog before about some of our fake Lego and not being sure what we were going to do with some of the ones that people had sold us as real Lego. Were we going to toss them? Were we going to save them for kids that visit the house to play with? Well, the collection of fake Lego that we've been sold as people saying they were real Lego, got big enough that we just went ahead and listed them on Facebook Marketplace, being honest that they are fake Lego. I don't say are... fake Lego, I say non-Lego. Because non there's some things in there that are like mega blocks or okay. stuff like that. But there are definitely some fake, right. like Chinese uh, made uh, Lego. So they're, they're definitely in there. But again, I was very honest. My whole point of this, a, it's super cheap. It's like 40 bucks for the whole bag. And there's all kinds of Marvel and Star Wars. I said, you know, this is what you want your kids to play with. You don't want your kids playing with a $60, $70, $100. I mean, imagine if your kid had a, a Thrawn or a Queen Amidala minifigure. Um, that's like a $200 minifigure. You don't want them playing with that. Yeah. So uh, just let them, have, let them have this to play with and they, can, they don't know the difference. So um, we're meeting a guy to sell those and then we're doing something that... I never do that most people do all the time <laughs> but I have sworn that I would never do it is I'm going to Walmart and I know that may not sound like a big deal unless you know me well but I'm now addicted to Walmart candles and I usually make Drew go get them for me but yeah. I actually want to go to Walmart today and we can look for the Wednesday doll 
that we've been looking for. We can get coffee. We need coffee. <laughs> um, I need Jolly Ranchers. You know, I'm all the normal things Ranch. that people vlog about in life. They're just like the super vloggable moments. All right, Jolly Ranchers. Let's talk Jolly Ranchers. Are you being One serious right now? What's the best flavor? I say hands down, it's watermelon. I am not going to seriously have this conversation. I think it's interesting. Watermelon Jolly Ranchers. This is just, we're just middle of the day. We'll check the Lego. We'll see clearance. Like maybe there's some great clearance sets in there. We'll I want to see. Do all kinds of stuff. So I've, I've been seeing on reels a lot of like the, the holiday merch at Walmart. So I actually kind of want to look at it. But this is just our middle of the day. We still have Agatha all along coming up. Four hours. Tonight. Um, but this is where we are. I am almost out of sorting the gray bucket. Oh. I think that, yeah, there's like. The, well, it's just that, like, you know, there's more gray. The bucket that yeah. I'm in. Yeah. So it's been a good day so far, and the day is not even over yet. Are you really recording? Yeah. Looking at my head? I just, I she know. stepped inside of Walmart. This is. It's so pretty. A Polynesian ivy. It is I've pretty. Never seen anything like I need to get a buggy and put it in there? I don't know. It's pretty. Plants make you happy. It makes me very happy. Like a ridiculous amount of happy. Are these real? <laughs> Are you being serious? Yeah. <laughs> it's nice in here. Oh, this is the one I keep seeing. Uh, we pass these in every flower bed, and I go, I want a piece of that. <laughs> <And> that's, <laughs> that's I say I want a piece of that too, but it's not about flower beds. <laughs> Stop recording for me. Here's what I've wanted, but she'll never do it. And we, we got frogs now and they could help, but look at us. Basil, rosemary, make your own cilantro. Think about how this would thrive in Florida. Eggplant. But that's what I was just saying. We have frogs. We have like our, we've been invaded by frogs, but we're okay with it because they've been, they've been getting all the, other bugs. Other bugs. When you live by water. There's tangerine tree. By the way, that guy took the uh, lemon tree. took those Lego and he said exactly what I wanted to hear. He said, my kid is going to love these. And then when I said, yeah, that's exactly what I wanted to go with as a kid. Because some of these minifigures would have been very expensive for a kid to play with. And he goes, exactly. So it went to the perfect person. Super happy about that. Look at this. They've got Christmas trees out. Are oh, you get a little small bag like that? Yeah, that small bag is the same price as the That's true. full size bag, unless they're just. Selling. Are white trees going to come back in, Fair? I mean, I don't know that they're out. They're this is nice. Have to fit the vibe of your house. Yeah. But this is not a white tree. This is a flocked tree, and that is one hundred percent on trend. Flocked means it's a green tree that has snow sprayed on it. My grandmother had a white tree every this year. This is the white tree. Yeah. This is a flocked tree. Yeah, that's that's beautiful. And it's $189. Walmart trees are usually really good prices. Speaking of, I just remembered, because I'm like Jones in to put our trees up. I just remembered that the lights are all dead on our tree, remember? Oh, yeah. They all died last year. That's okay. We'll get them off. We'll get new ones. But it's beginning to look a lot like... <laughs> <laughs> Christmas in September. My smell. Mm. Get that one. Get, get several. Mm -hmm. Smell the hazelnut cream. I do want to smell the... What's the pumpkin spice smell like? Alpine forest, even though that's more Christmas, but that is my favorite smell in the whole world. <laughs> that is my favorite smell in the whole world. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Oh my God. I'm gonna wait till Christmas though. I don't wanna. So they only have that big pumpkin spice candle? I don't candle? wanna go there that fast. Okay, let's see. Pumpkin spice, you're saying this is pumpkin spice? Yeah, but that's the big one. That's not the 396 one. Mm, that smells like Main Street. Yeah, that's yeah. nice. I don't see a regular one. Yeah. But I mean, if that's gonna burn for a while, looks like the. Okay, we'll just get those two. One for upstairs, one for downstairs. Or, we'll be fine. 
Yay. She wants to look at these. I want to look at these. I haven't seen these in forever. I didn't know they still made those. Funko mugs. Those are cute. I don't know what they are. But, but I want a dimple. But look at them I want a funny. dimple. I want a dimple. Although we never ever use our Funko Pop coffee mugs. But they must have like re-released these. I thought they stopped making them. That's cute. I like all these. This looks like a... Uh, all right, I've made it back to the toy section, and per the use, the Wednesday dolls are missing. Of course, there's always Cousin It and the hand. Sometimes there's even the uh, other, there's a, a girl in a pink dress doll, but no Wednesday doll. Wah, wah, wah. Do you have one of these when we were kids? Do we have one of those when no, we were kids? I absolutely have one of those. I remember we sitting under the porch and making snow cones for everyone in the neighborhood i love that it's new and improved because this right here when you have now. to crank that yes i oh my god i'm sure i did if you asked for one i wasn't that much of a jerk like a little stitch purse. I want one of those stitch purses. no wednesday dolls how much was the snippy snow cone machine i don't know i'm not looking back over there but <laughs> Pound puppies? Pound puppies. I collected these. There's Play Doh. Fairless Play Doh. I hate Play Doh. Play Doh. I absolutely I kids were little, I had despise an entire them. kitchen cabinet. There was an entire cabinet in our kitchen dedicated to Play Doh and the Play Doh toys. Bleh. Kids were little. Bleh. Trolls. Hello, Wells. All right, let's check out Legends and Lego. We're Lego first. Of course, per use, I'm always looking for clearance or maybe new sets that are harder to find. I still love this set for you. But of course, our, our biggest thing is if we ever want to go see Peter Pan and Wendy, we just go to Magic Kingdom. <laughs> but that's a cute set. That's how we rationalize to keep ourselves overspending <laughs> on, on Lego. Lego. I've got lots of good stuff, though. They are well stocked at this Walmart. I do not have any of the Dungeons and Dragons I'm minifigures. Ask you like I asked the kids. But we already have. This is what I asked the kids some days. If I said you could have anything here, Oof. what would you choose? Also, anything? There's, yeah, there's Harry Potter and Disney down there. Yeah. If you could have anything on this aisle. Well, you know, I'm always going to lean Star Wars. Of course, this set right here. I've been wanting to actually get this set because one of the things that's pretty popular right now in the Bricklink world is to just get the sticker sheet and sell the individual pieces um, with each one of the stickers like that right there. See those are all stickers. Like even the Pam's drawing of the office building that's a stickered piece and I would love to fill my Bricklink store with office stickers but to answer your question. Hmm. Like just for me to build? Yeah, like if you're a kid, I, and I said, I've really you been wanting this one. Here? I've wanted this one. This is actually really hard to find too. It keeps selling out like crazy. And this just released on Disney Plus. I would want the Dark Millennium Falcon. I just think it's really cool. Okay. You seem disappointed in that. No, it's fun. I would like. The Bumblebee Transformers, but he's not at the right scale. And then, of course, I love the minifigures in this set. What about you? Well, I think we all know what Lego set I want, and it's not here, so I don't even like a. I know that's not <gasps> Ooh, the game. This is new. I love that Mr. Freeze right there. I want more the rings. Like she the no, they don't have Rivendell or. The tower here. Oh, this one's cool. <gasps> That's not Lego. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Brickcraft. Tell them why I got excited, though. Because we just recently watched the MTV documentary on Netflix. I don't know what it was on. It was really good. But about it was even down to like 
like how this logo like got created. Yeah, it was really good. Oh, here's another set I would definitely <laughs> take. So and I'm though. really shocked that I don't They've have this. They got this. They made this whole box to make it look like it's yeah. part of that. Yeah. They'll get some of them because they'll get. Them. Oh my God! Well, there's look. another one, Yellowstone. That's not Lego. It's, <laughs> it's Yellowstone. That's hilarious. Yellowstone Lego. It's just the cattle head. But it's not Lego. No, nope, it's the same. It's Brickcraft. Hey, everybody wants in the game. Let's go look at Legends. All right, before we look at Legends, y'all know we love some adorables. Oh look at that Darth Maul adorable. Oh my gosh. Look at little Wicked. Here's the thing. I am absolutely obsessed with adorables now, but the problem is I'm going to open every single one of them expecting for it to be an $800 yeah. adorable like the one I got at Comic-Con. No. And I just feel like that's constant disappointment. But this is nice. <laughs> I would definitely get this. Look at the Queen Amidala adorable. That's cute. Let's do Ewoks. There's Leia. Those are, those are adorable. Kind of the point, right? Yeah. All right, the legends here are not great, per usual. We just don't quite understand what's going on in the legends world. Like why they're so hard to keep of why stuff. you can't find anything. But the Fuddlers. The Fuddlers were really big at Comic Con. They were. I what think they're the they're one, cute. What was the one our daughter was looking for? It wasn't Turtles, was it? Uh, was it Gravity Falls? Mm -hmm. I don't know. But no Legends, no restocks of X Men '97, none of the new stuff. Oh, we are we are very excited. Or at least I am. Me and the boy are very excited about Secret Wars Legends release that was just announced. So, those will definitely be coming down the pike. The pipe? Pipe or pipe? You know what? What is it? Is it pike or pipe? I think it's pipe. I don't know. Pike is what it sounds like, but why would it be coming down the pike? Like the street? These are Black Series. Pike coming down the street? <laughs> like Covington Pike? <laughs> There's a Memphis flashback. <laughs> All right. I was today's years old. Today's? <laughs> Today year old when I found out they have Peppa Pig Legos. When did you become obsessed with Peppa Pig? Oh gosh, it's been a long time. I think Peyton time. was a baby. I love Peppa Pig. If I still had kids, these would be... You still have kids. <laughs> <laughs> we still have kids. Babies. <laughs> these would be in the house. That's funny. All right, first time I've seen it in person, Nightmare Before Christmas set. I will say I definitely do like the longer legs, Jack. Definitely a great set. And as far as I can tell, I do not see it here in stock at Disney Springs Lego store. All right, we are headed to the Agatha premiere. Nothing outside for it. We'll see what's going on inside. We're obviously our number one thing we're interested in is the posters. Looks like they're actually sending us to the back. Interesting. We went to scan our tickets and they were like, nope, go this way. So. Looks like they have a special interest for us right here. Cast members only. And yep, they are checking us in the back. This is fun. I feel a little VIP-ish. See what we get. All right, here's the giveaway. A lovely Agatha All Along poster. And we got special wristband events, Walt Disney. And it's in Theater One, which is the Dolby. Yep, we're in the Dolby Theater. Look. Yay! So we actually had to come up to the third level because we did not get here soon enough. It is packed. Unless you want to sit on the very front row, which is all good. But we're in the Dolby Theater. I'm going to get some popcorn. Drew is home, and he announced his arrival by letting me know that he went to the Lego store without me <laughs> and did the pick-a-brick wall well, without me. Because I got that piece. 
<laughs> and he was like, guess what? I got more grays. And I'm like, are you kidding me? I'm almost done with the gray bucket. And I just loaded in like a hundred of those. I didn't get very many of those. But I do like all the pretty colors. So he's sorting. Yeah, so I used my some rewards and, of course, pass holder discount. And all of these lovely pieces, as Kylo comes in here, uh, uh, is... Kylo is what we call our vacuum cleaner. Was $11. The Lego is separating us, but tell me about your event last night. Uh, Agatha was really good. I did feel like they did a really good job. They had security everywhere. They made us put our phones up. So that's why, like, after I showed uh, the Dolby Theater, like, there was nothing else. Because they were like, put your phones up. Uh, which is very Disney. But it was really good. Uh, first episode, I'm not going to give any spoilers, but the first episode was a little slow. But the second episode, like, really picked up and, like, hooked me in. Which is funny because the rumors I've been hearing was that it was the third episode that was going to hook you in. But I got hooked in in the second. We only saw the first two. Uh, but That's it was pretty cool, though, that you got to... So when does the... When does today. It officially, okay, so it comes out today. So last today. night you got to go see both episodes in the yep. theater. And still wearing... But still far. wearing my little He's so Disney excited. Like, yeah, that's probably my favorite. Like, I love the poster, but the fact that that says Walt Disney World special event, like, that's cool. That's a lot of fun. But I, I think it's going to be a fun show. I think um, I'm really excited. There's nine episodes, one per week. So I'm looking forward to seeing you watch it, see what you think. And it's just, it's just fun. It was a fun event. There was other vloggers there. So it was really fun. And I can't wait to the next one. If, you had to, if I had to guess, a skeleton crew should be. Okay. Yeah. You know what would really be interesting is when Daredevil comes out and we can only take oh, two of us see. out of the four of us. I who think maybe Daredevil. Can, I think maybe you let the kids go by themselves. Maybe. Like we did with Deadpool Wolverine. I think that's where you let the kids go. Or we just buy another membership. <laughs> maybe. I don't know. So uh you have just watched a Monday, Tuesday and now Wednesday yeah. morning vlog. If you're ever <laughs> ever curious <laughs> what we're doing, um this is like our normal days, and uh, it's been a lot of fun. I, we might go to Epcot tonight. I'm not sure, but for the most part, we're just going to be um, working in the BrickLink store and enjoying life. So, in the meantime... Don't dork yourself! Don't dork yourself! It was the dorkeries all along. The dorkeries.